is Matthew and today I will be showing you some attacks I made on Boom Beach. I will start by showing you one about Dr. Terror. So this is stage one. Uh, it's n it wasn't very hard. And so I succeeded. So now I'm going to drop my troops on that side and then they will attack the HQ avoiding the machine gun. Flaring to the HQ. Uh, warriors are a bit naughty sometimes so it's good to keep a flare on you on your hands to guide them. So I also managed to attack stage uh, two. I think yes. I'm gonna be showing you that one. Uh, this was a bit hard to, uh, but I managed to do it as well. Uh, and with the warriors, it's likely to use stealth for stealth and try to go uh, a bit in back back of the HQ to avoid the other defenses because they are high max they are highly leveled and that could do a great number of damage so I throw a couple of rockets and uh, some uh, medkit to help my warriors defeat this base. It was a bit powerful, as I said, but I won. I didn't attack any more stages because they were a bit hard for me. But I did attack a couple of other bases, so let me see. Uh, there's stage one. There's oh, this is some. I t I attacked a level twenty player, same as my level. Uh, it was a bit easy because. Uh, a sniper tower and a cannon were disabled on the left side and they were out of range of the HQ. I threw a shot quieting down the defenses. The sniper towers were a bit of a problem there but I quickly took care of them and tried to stop them. Throw another shock there, just in case. More shocks. And finally, a med kit. Now, gonna get rid of a bit of health from that. Uh, flare to the sniper tower, break it and. Now straight to the HQ, get some loot, and flare the flare, just like that, for just for fun. Uh, I have more, I shared more, so I'm going to show you a bit more about them. Uh, here we go. This is done to the wire, it was a very cannony place but I won even though a lot of troops died here but like the cannons are a very powerful defense but my warriors just took care of that them through a shock make it a bit easier for them but I won in this and it was very clear that I would succeed so, I'm gonna show you, uh, I think, the last one, which I attacked lately. 
which was down no uh, a bird world it was hard for uh, those sniper towers in a row and I decided to attack on the left hand side but uh, I had level 2 warriors here and uh, they're powerful plus I have a level uh, a guardian 11 more health and 5% more 11% uh, more health and 5% more damage so I got a bit boosted up plus I had a, a guardian of more resources which gave me a bit more of my money so uh, that was enough of attacking normal bases now I will show you uh, an operation we had made uh, not long. So uh, from here it was yes. So let me show you an attack we made. So uh, Zach Lord bases one of my teammate. I mean task force mate. Uh, and he started this attack, which then I finished out, and we won. So we have thrown now the troops. Gonna do like that to see better. Uh, I think that's me, not him. Oh, that's this is me. This is me. So I lost because those rocket launchers were. Uh, very hard to destroy, so I shocked them. Then I, I just got rid of some of the mortars, which would have been causing problems. But unfortunately, rocket launchers are too powerful to mess with. But with the help of Zeklord Base, or whatever his name is, we have succeeded. So now I will show you the fishing results. So he blew up the whole base with his rockets. Boom. Oh, I could have that bit there. Oh, the little life left. Mm. Turning down his troops. The warriors, uh, they're heading straight to the cannons. Told you warriors are a bit naughty. They like love danger. They just go straight to danger. Uh, which, what, what, the good thing about this battle was that like the, each time the warriors were hit, they like healed themselves quickly. So I'm gonna speed this up a bit because it's, it would take long, like... So, if you can see, if you can see, like, when they are damaged, they just heal themselves quickly, and then when they get hit again, they continue the process. Heal and be damaged and heal. Until the... HQ was destroyed thanks to five riflemen and five warriors. Cause one of them ended up in his grave in this. So, uh, gummy bears another guy in my uh, task force. He has attacked too. But he didn't do much damage because fairly this base was very hard. That's why I decided not to attack. So, uh, he didn't do any damage to the defenses. The only thing he did was he destroyed a power cell. Which still got us a, a task point, a force point. So there we see him breaking out that power cell. And he 
continues to move next to the next star cell, doing a useless flare. But as you can see, he'll still end up there. Like, let me count how many rocket launchers there are. Nine rocket launchers terribly do damage to just a heavy and a couple of riflemen. So let me check if there are any more. Uh, I don't think there is. Okay, maybe we went to the... So this is me attacking cargo. Okay. Oh, I remember this. We did not do anything totally. Like, I attacked and failed. But, uh, the rocket launchers were, had a lot of health. Like, and they threw like millions of rockets. So, like, with the first wave of rockets, was sur two survived. So it was clearly end of the line. Let me see if there are any more. No, this is the same one. Okay, no more available. So uh, this is, I think, this is the end of the video. Thanks, guys, for watching. Uh, and well, I next time I do a Boom Beach video, we're going to open this time Mulkran. And we're going to attack Mokran. So, we're going to open it. And tomorrow and someday else, we will uh, share the replays with you. Even if we fail. Which is a very likely option. So, here we go. Let me now scout them. So let's start scaring this guy. So, hmm. Hard. Nope. So, thanks guys for watching and bye.